Thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. I had a villain on all our side. I had to go and make you all mine. And I know it's the right time. Can't envision nothing else. I need you, need you, need you right now. Need you, need you, need you when I feel down. I know you're the one for me now. Nothing gonna stop me, I'm gonna slow down. Got to love you, I got, got to love you, got to love you, I got. Hello everyone, welcome to another studio vlog. I am just a few days out from launching a bunch of stuff in my store. Today we're gonna be doing the last little tidbits. Chris is coming over, we're gonna count all the stock. We're gonna shoot some stuff. I'm gonna do some packaging for some of the stuff, but I'm excited. I have been waiting to do this store launch for a while. I just have to, I had to keep pushing it back just because of busyness and not having things be delivered yet. The stickers you saw me designing in the last video are here. I'm really excited. First things first, I have to clean. It's not that bad, but I want Chris to be able to work comfortably and I just want a clear space. So I'm gonna do that. Yay. Okay, cute, I like it. We don't have very many orders that are less than A5, right? Nothing will be shipped in a envelope this small. Mm. I'm excited to see, which ones are the stickers? Uh, this one. Okay, let's look at these. I'm nervous, because I don't know what it's gonna look like with the decal paper. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know I, how big the paper is I gonna be. I might have to trim off some of the sides. Oh my God, cool, that looks actually quite nice. So the main thing I wanna do today, I had a list somewhere. So I need to punch holes in all the little label thingies. What I need you to do mainly is count stock and input it, like basically the stuff for the store back yeah. end. Mm -hmm. So it's counting stock and inputting it and adding the variants for the T's and for the originals. Yeah, okay. Can you cut the prints for me? Cause I want to shoot those today. And then that's pretty much it. And then we just roll the T's. I think we can, we'll do that together and I think it'll be fast. Yeah. How do you want to organize like medium, small? Do you want me to write it onto the labels? Yeah, the label should say the size. Then All right. We don't need to unravel them. All right, I'll make like, um, if you just count how many there are, then I'll make that number. Excuse me, Tonka, that's not a toy. That's Chris's business gear. Cause you steady on my mind. If two's a party, then let's get it started. Put the gear in drive. We are your life. Ain't worry about the haters. Push them to the side. If you feel it right, you feel in a vibe. Put the pedal to the metal cause it's gold time. Got to love you, I got, got to love you. Got to love you, I got, got to love you. Got to love you, I got, got to love you. Got to love you, I. I just want to say thank you to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. This afternoon, I sat down with Tom Froze, who's an illustrating designer from Vancouver and did his class, Odd Bodies Illustrating Expressive Stylized People. I think there was six exercises and all of them aim to like loosen you up and to think about form in a different way. I think that I'm too literal sometimes when it comes to the things I draw and it limits all the poses and all the emotions that I can get out of my illustration. But with this class, I was able to think about form and shape and line and new way so really really happy that I did it I'm gonna leave this class below for you guys in the pinned comments so you can do it too and if you don't have Skillshare you can go to the link in my description there are free memberships of Skillshare premium for the first thousand people to click the link in my description if you guys want that go get it it's free Skillshare is really really good it's ten dollars a month which is crazy because whenever I feel demotivated or feeling a little bit rusty, I can sit down and find like an hour long class or a half hour class and it really, really jump starts like my creativity. I really appreciate it. That's priceless to me. Thank you, Skillshare, and go get your free trials. Got to love you, I Hello, everyone. I don't know how much of it's going to be a studio vlog this time because we have a special day planned, don't we, sweetheart? We are gonna go get a so, Christmas tree. Yes, but not just any Christmas tree. We are gonna be getting a Wallamai pine. You know we're actually going to Wallamai National Park. Are we? That's cool. Surely we have. 
Wow, so we'll be able to see what they look like when they're fully grown. No, because they're secret. You don't know where they are. Oh, yeah. yeah. I'll explain the history. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, yeah, I'm going to do it now. <laughs> no, I do it in post. <laughs> I need a boom, fact. boom, boom. I need a fact check. <laughs> Rocket's planned out an amazing day, haven't you, Sadie? Not an amazing day. It's just I think a nice it sounds cool. Saturday. We're gonna go on a little drive. We're gonna go on Bell's Line Road, which is to some people in Sydney, they know it as like the pie road because there's lots of pie shops on it. <laughs> also, to non Australians, pies are like a food. Not a dessert. What? Oh yeah, that's because, what, yeah. Well, I mean, I eat apple pie, but in Australia, talking. we eat pies. Yeah, so we're going on this little road trip to get, basically just to hang out and get a Christmas tree and eat pies and like check out apple orchards. Even though it's not like season, not but season. they've got lots of places that make like nice apple ciders and things like that. You know what I would love? That one we got from Logan Brain. I know, they're closed today. <laughs> yeah. Rocket's ready, I'm late. Yep. Oh no, quick, rub it all in. Boyfriend narrates my morning routine. Okay, here we go. <laughs> so now I contemplate what I'm gonna put on next. Crack my fingers to really loosen up the joints. Does my fringe look good? Yes, it looks perfect. Like You're giving me insecurity? Wow, I look really <laughs> ugly today. <laughs> Rub it all through my chin. It's all about the chin. It's all about my big huge chin. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I start on the right, but today I'm starting on the left. Most days I start on the left. In fact, scrap that, I always start on the left. Do you know where my handbag is? Boyfriend grabs my handbag. You can almost <laughs> see it in the mirror. Okay, moving on to the right eye. Three, two, one, and we are done. My eye's a bit crooked today. This is like weirdly open. Do you see? Oh my god. Answer Maybe. carefully! <laughs> <laughs> I look into the mirror and realize my face is perfect. <laughs> I grab this pen that I need not because my face is perfect. Oh, honey! I quickly do an ASMR video. She grabs a handful of moisturizer from a deep tub, applies it to the skin of the hand. <laughs> rubbing both hands against each other. Now, stand up and enjoy the day. <laughs> stand up. The victory dance has commenced and we are ready to run. Run. I like you a lot, I don't know how you do it. We are getting out randomly because Rocket was like, oh, a junkyard. I know, fancy. So cute. This is cool. This is like a movie. Yeah. You know me too well, how you get right to it. It's not just your words, you get all my feelings. You got me feeling right, dancing on the ceiling. Where are you going? I'm going to Fun Town. Fun Town? Yeah. Sounds fun. No, it's actually a really sad place. <laughs> Popping, so we must be pretty high up. Look, there's a view. Oh, a view. Oh, I don't know if I can see that. My ears are popping. Rocket says his ears are popping. So unless it's a strange coincidence, we're pretty high up right now. Look at those trees over there. Anything that's like taller. Is it a pine? Yeah, we're going to pie in the sky. We're going to so pie in the sky. Okay. Apparently, it's famous. I'll show you the pie in five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. A sniffy, sniffy. Does it smell good? Actually, it smells really good. Can I smell? Oh my god, it smells good. He was not lying. It does <laughs> smell good. Wait, oh no, my fork. It's still good. It's still good. Ah, romantic. A lovely bent for my lady. Do you want to have the first little taste? Oh, you don't have the first little taste. Give me that. Okay, so this is a pie. In Australia, pies are often filled with savoury goods. This one's filled with chicken and corn. Oh no, it's a chicken and mushroom they gave us instead of chicken and corn. Oh no. What, what do we do? But you hate mushroom. I know. It's fine. It's pretty good. You have to eat the mushroom, but I was really looking forward to that corn. I know, that's the only reason we bought that. It's fine. 
Come on, let's go bring it back. No, then. let's not. It's too. You can't bring it back to a small town place. You can't. It's not nice. They have to put it out of their pocket. Oh, fine. Not a big deal. How the is crush it? Is so good. The crust. Is the crust even better than Burke Street Bakery? Oh, no, she didn't. Oh my. It's doing the dirty work and eating the dirty mushrooms. I mm. hate mushrooms. They're so slimy. It's like what I imagine a slug to taste, like a raw slug. That's tasty. So now we're off to either the apple pie cottage or Bilpin Cider. I think Bilpin Cider comes first. <gasps> yes, I would love a sip of cider, non-alcoholic. Yeah. yeah. There's another pie shop if you want. No thanks. I've had been traumatized by not giving me my pie that I like, <gasps> a giant fruit ball. That's what I feel down we can <laughs> Here's the thing, it's not that it was a bad meal, but I asked for the chicken and corn pie and they gave me the chicken and mushroom. Are you realizing how silly it was? It is, is it sounds silly, but I still feel sad. Sean, please, so please sorry. let it go. I can't. Please. I will not. It's every documented time I go outside for apples. Are you filming? Oh, it's good. Not quite like my beloved hot apple juice. Should I really be having four glasses worth of apple juice? It's a bit crazy for a small girl like me. Okay, this is the raspberry and apple one. It tastes like a red frog. It yeah, tastes like a red yeah, frog. Yeah, it does. That's a good point. Oh, so this one Rocket hasn't tried, so I can give him all of the gossip. That's good. It's like lemon squash with... I don't even taste the apple. Last but not least, this is the ginger. Pretty good. Not the best I've had. What's your favorite, Sean? I think it might be the original or the lemon. <laughs> Apples. Wow, they're so small. Hello, little children. You're going to grow up to be a delicious treat or a drink or pie. <laughs> Enjoy your life. Purple apple. <laughs> Purple apple. <laughs> Heaven. Heaven. Honey, someone been eating these apples! Someone's been eating these apples! Who ate that? And on the right one, I'm too choosy. All them other ones, they don't know how to do it. I think we're here! And you ask, I hope there's a toilet, I really have to pee. She's got the right stuff, pocket where it leans. If I'm on the the flyers that I ever did see. If you want it, then you want it. That's how I see. Where's our beloved wallaby pie? The tree first. Baby, which one do you like the best? There are also just a couple over there, but I'm, I'm, I'm not sure. Maybe that one. Oh, that's pretty. Looks pretty strong. This might be the one. I think this is the one. You reckon that's the one? Yeah. Looking pretty healthy. Yeah. Our baby. Yeah, I like it. Do you? I love how scraggly they are. They're so cute. This one's still. Rain supreme. Yeah, I think so. All right, our sweet new baby, and we're gonna call him Wally. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so this is what the bark is going to look like one day, hopefully. This is a fossil. So I gather this is for a gift? No, this is for us. We're using it as a Christmas tree for the rest of our lives. Oh, excellent. Ooh, I really like it. Oh. <laughs> I'm always finished. Rocket has a golden gay time. Mm. What do you rate your gay time out of 10? Six. Why Maybe do you get five. them all the time? Yeah. Out of 10? Or five? Out of ten. Six out of ten? That's not good at all. It's not like I just... Wait, I'm rating it on... We're rating on the scale of Paddle Pop ice cream. Not like gelato. Oh, seven and a half then? Mine's a... I'd say a nine. Golden Gate times are just like nostalgic. I think you should get extra points. I've got four tables in at the moment, so you're probably more than fine to just wander in. Yeah, cool. And when does the kitchen reopen for five dinner? Five o'clock for dinner. Okay, yeah. five o'clock for dinner. And are you pretty packed out tonight for booking? Not at the five o'clock sitting. Um, we have three sittings, so 5 o'clock, 6.45 or 8.30, oh, yeah. the middle one is full. But okay, if you want to have dinner at 5 o'clock, we could definitely do that. Let's do 5 o'clock, yeah, that'd be great. Um, we are just serving set menus at the moment as well. Um, you, is there any chance to be on our website and have a look? Thank you very yeah. much. See ya. Cheers. Thanks. Done. Are you glad we called? Oh, are you glad we called? Yeah. This is going to be way, way more fun. Sweetie, um, should I go paying for the dinner? No. Yes. Let's clean up your chocolate now, okay? 
let's just, just watch out. You got chocolate here, you got chocolate here, you got chocolate here. Time to fill my bladder up again. Love you to the 